freaking exciting. What is going on? Facebook friends, Facebook family, YouTube. We are everywhere in your face because we want to help you look better, feel better, and live your best life. My name is Jennifer Abs. This is my very, very good friend, Jason. And we are here to just share some information with you, something that we've come across. Um, it's helping us. It's helping our families. It's changing lives. And, and so we're going to get right into it. But first, I'd like to introduce to you my very good friend, Jason. So Jason's been in the healthcare profession for over 20 years. He does martial arts. He's married. He's an empty nester, just had his last one graduate in Arizona last Friday. He's a, he's a big mini me. Uh, and he is just a phenomenal leader in our industry. And he's a brother. He is a friend. He's a husband. He's just doing all the things in our company and with our team and with our organization. Um, and he's just mega mind. He's just got this brilliant, brilliant mind and this massive, massive heart to help other people. So Jason, thank you for joining me today. Hey, I almost didn't make it here. I literally just got off work at the hospital. So forgive me for just showing up in scrubs, but I figure, you know, this is real life, right? And we just, we show up as, as we are. And so thank you very much. I appreciate that, Jennifer. Um, yeah. So empty nesting. I can't believe it. We're kind of opposite ends of the spectrum. You know, we just ended up uh, sending our, our youngest daughter, uh, 20 years old now, off to, to college up in Oregon. So she's a OSU beaver now. So having a good time. Uh, and you're on the other end. You know, you've got some young girls. You know, I think you got you got four kids, right? So you got two daughters, a son and a husband, right? Yes. So I, I, th I think we decided that you're a mother of four. Um, and man, I, I see you there, you know, getting started with your day with your little green drink. How appropriate for us to really start with, you know, just the nutrition and, and the health made simple. And Jennifer's right. You know, I've been in, I've been in healthcare for about 30 years now. Um, definitely working on my exit plan. I, I love taking care of patients, but more than once I was introduced to really this industry and, and the doctor that we're going to uh, share some more information about, I really, my mind really opened up is that, you know, I don't have to just take care of patients in the hospital or in a building or in a clinic, but I can not only take care of patients outside and help them live their best life, but I can also live my best life as well. And when I started using the nutrition and I'll tell you, Dr. Cohn, Jennifer's going to introduce to you uh, a little bit more about Dr. Cohn, but he is one of my uh, personal physicians uh, and I've been uh, uh, using his services for the last three and a half years now. And my Lord, Jennifer, it has changed my life. But um, I'm going to I'm going to turn this over to you uh, real quick and, and kind of introduce the doctor and I'll, I'll bring up the slide and, and we can get started. Yeah, sounds good. So this is our doctor. And uh, so this is Dr. Cohen. And he's not only a health practitioner for, for Jason, but for my good friend, Char. Um, we just got back from a huge convention where the doctor was there. We all got to, I mean, I've, I've met him twice now, personally. Um, he has a health practitioner um, office in Costa Mesa, California, with quite an extensive waiting list because of what he is doing in the industry, which is kind of disrupting it a little bit with one of our products. Um, so he's a 30 year healthcare practitioner. <clears throat> he's trained over 50 doctors and he's helped over 55,000 patients. And he really recognized that while helping all those patients, there really was four underlying root, like underlying, I won't say root causes because the, what he created actually pulls out the root. So we're not band-aiding these problems with more, you know, other words, I won't say OTC over the counter stuff. He actually has created a line to help create the alkalinity in our body. And I'll let Jason get into all that because the science and stuff, like I drink it, I drink it because I'm told to drink it. It tastes amazing for any of those looking like, what is she drinking? It's green. It's green. It tastes like fruit. It's delicious. And I don't have to wonder if I got my nutrition in for the day, which I think we all can agree that I'm not even sure they sell groceries like food at the grocery store anymore. We're not really sure what's happening there. Right. So, so this is our doctor. Um, he has helped an insane amount of patients. He, he works with us very, very directly. Um, and, and, and Jason, do you want to talk a little about the pro we want to leave the products for the end talk about the telemedicine? <clears throat> uh, yeah, just I mean, just whenever whenever you're ready, we'll kind of just kind of jump right into it. You know, uh, do you have anything else to say about the, the doctor and the evolution and everything? 
Um, no. <laughs> uh, hey, yeah, no worries. So let me just kind of uh, jump in there. So again, like Jennifer said, Dr. Cohn, phenomenal, phenomenal gentleman who is a basically a naturopathic physician, um, Eastern medicine versus Western medicine. We really understand that there's a vast difference of both, right? Um, what I've come to notice is in Western medicine, we usually just prescribe something to take care of a problem. And uh, when people come to us, they present themselves with problem. Uh, we end up prescribing something uh, to deal with those symptoms or, you know, the issues that people are having. It, now, Eastern medicine, on the other hand, they go to the source. They prevent problems from arising, right? And so when you, when you actually take care of the host itself, then the rest of it just kind of falls into play. And then we don't need to go to the doctor to fix a problem that never came Right. And so that's what I really, really enjoy with the philosophy that Dr. Cohn has to offer all of us. And, you know, if if you if you haven't had an opportunity, it's the Cohn Health Institute. You can Google it, C-O-H-N Health Institute, and you can see what he's got uh, in Southern California. He's actually got uh, and you may have mentioned this, but he has trained well over 50 physicians in the art of holistic medicine. She's treated well over 50,000 uh, patients across the world. The reason why Dr. Cohn has his institute right outside in Costa Mesa, right outside the airport is for that reason, because people will fly in for a, a doctor visit to spend an hour with him, his wife, Christine, or uh, any one of the other physicians, naturopathic physicians that he employs at his office. So just a good, good plug to, you know, really reach out, do your research, Yes. And, uh, and, and, and look at what Dr. Cohn's uh, Health Institute has to offer all of us. Now, you're right. I have been a, a, a patient of Dr. Cohn's. He is a chiropractor, so I've, I've definitely had some uh, adjustments, you know, more than what we normally think about as, as just the physical adjustment. But really, when you, when you look at it, in order to really deal with the host, we have to get deeper into the psychology, the, the physiology, the emotions that, that really tend to uh, uh, cause a problem with our health. You say, right? Fair to say? Yeah. So when we talk about the products that Dr. Cohn um, has been the creator of, he, he's you know, been in this industry for well over 30 years. And what he realized after about 10 years in is that there's so many different supplements and, uh, and stuff out there that was just filled with crap. Forgive my language, but it just wasn't the best of the best that was out there. We're going to be real here, right? When, when we talk about whey, uh, whey proteins, and, and that's, that's a waste. It is I a waste product, right? And yes, that's why people bulk up with whey because it, it causes inflammation. It causes gas and bloating. Uh, and so I know when I was, you know, like you said, I, I've worked out in the martial arts uh, for a few decades now. But, um, you know, that's one of the things that we always looked at is how do we bulk up and how do we get the, a protein uh, if we're busy grab and go type stuff. Yeah. Uh, and, and so what Dr. Cohn did is he really went to the, the science part of this. And that's why he's the science advisory board director of, of our company right? Is because he knows all the science. Jennifer, you're not a product expert. I'm not a product expert. I am a product consumer. I am passionate about all of the products that we have. I did just have my, my shake in, in, in greens this morning. And I'll tell you, um, I need a little bit more, especially coming out of, of today, you know, just coming post call and, and I've got a, a, a day full of stuff to do today. I just needed to have something quick. Yeah. And so what I did is I added some steel cut oats to, to my shake. You know, it bolted up a little bit, something that's healthy. I added some blueberries in there and some ice and I made it a smoothie, right? Nice. So there's so much uh, that we can do. And when we talk about, you know, I'm team chocolate. I don't, I don't know who, who else is out there. <laughs> my, my, my friend, uh, uh, Char, who was pretty cool, kind of introduced me to this concept of uh, team chocolate you know, Jen is team vanilla, but there's some people out there that are, are team tuxedo. <laughs> yes, I heard, I saw that too. I've seen that Put too. Put a little bit of both of them in there. Mm. You know, so, so the protein part of this um, it is, is so powerful, you know, to have zero grams of sugar, to have calories that are around 120 calories. Jen, when's the last time you had a meal that was less than 200 calories and 
we're full and satisfied. Yeah, I probably was starving. <laughs> right? So, so for, for people out there that are looking to count calories, you know, here's another option. Now, let me let me be very clear. I truly believe in in consuming food, right? And eating natural food. Yes. So important not to just take supplements out there and have a diet full of pills, right? Yes. So when we talk about nutrition, we want to make sure we're getting the, the, the premium, healthiest, organic type stuff within our system. You agree? Yeah. Now, when we talk about vegetables, right? I, I see you drinking a green shake here. Yeah. So do you have any concepts, Jen, as far as how much vegetables you and I need to have in a given day? It's in a order lot. To, yeah, it's a lot. You what know? would I could consume if I were just eating one at a time? Like it's if hours think, <laughs> If you think about how big the kitchen table is, mm -hmm. okay? If you filled the kitchen table from end to end and side to side with fresh, organic, you know, just picked vegetables, that would be about five servings of, of vegetables that you would need to consume every day. Yeah. Is that palatable? Is it possible? Sure, it's possible. But is it sustainable? No. Is it is it inexpensive? I don't know if you've been to the grocery store recently and have looked at what the cost of organic vegetables is, mm -hmm. um, but it's a pretty penny. And so when you when you look at what Dr. Cohn had had done, is he basically put um, five serving of vegetables into uh, four of these capsules or two, two scoops of, of your green shake there, right? And, and to be able to consume that in one setting with one meal, you have all of the vegetables and nutrients and organic you know, supplements that you need for the day. Yeah. You know, and, and again, I'm not a product expert. We have Dr. Cohn. We have Mr. Mike Zinardelli, Mr. USA. We have so many other people that are much more knowledgeable than I am on nutrition. So this isn't a, this isn't a, a scientific nutrition yo uh, topic right now. I'm yeah. just telling you uh, what I do and and the results that I'm having and, and people are telling me. And I'll tell you with these greens here. Now the difference is between the 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 um, the powdered greens and the capsules is the capsules are so much more potent, right? So mm -hmm. if you really want to have as much you know um, organic and quality that you have. Um, I would recommend grabbing the capsules. You just swallow them. You know, uh, they don't have a, a, an apple uh, a sweetener in them because obviously if you're having powdered stuff, it's got to be palatable. It is great tasting. You know, I can literally, you know, eat it off of a spoon and be fine with it. Right. It just depends on if you're if you have a texture sensitivity, but, you know, putting it, putting it in a glass of water, shaking it up, drinking it like a shot. I mean, I've drank wheatgrass before. Right now, that is not palatable, but, you know, it's it's healthy. And so that's the greens, the the shake and the greens. I usually do um, some uh, I do two to four capsules of the of the green caps a day and, and about two to three uh, scoops of the shake. Now, I use a little bit more on the, the protein because uh, uh, as an athletic uh, male, uh, I need a little bit more protein in my diet. Sure. And, and then for lunch, I'll just have a regular meal. Right. You know, like I say, what we want to do is we want to make sure that we are um, consuming food and or or healthy supplements. Right. Yeah. Any questions on the greens? No, but I'm just going to inject really quick because we're hearing from a medical professional and a lot of us are like, yeah, but why do I need it? Right. And I'm not a medical professional. So I'm going to share from a mom and from a person that I'm not necessarily into the research. I'm a person, if you're doing it and you're living and this is like, you know, we've got, we, you know, we can't do any medical claims. You're more than welcome to meet people that have gone through cancer, that have gone through hyperthyroid, hypothyroid. I met a man that had Crohn's disease, right? That, that our product literally changed his life. These are their stories, absolutely no medical claims. What I want you to know is as a mom who doesn't do the research, but I learned the stories and I learned the people. So you're like, well, Jen, I eat a salad a day. Me too. I consider myself a fairly healthy person, but that doesn't mean what's going on inside of our bodies is healthy because we can't see that. That's why we do need the medical, that's why we do need doctors. Yeah. I do want to say I loved, and I've heard this twice now from the stage, that Dr. Cohn is very much Eastern and Western, where he's like, what you believe 
what you are thinking as well as what, like if you're putting this into your body, but you're like, well, this tastes like crap and I'm probably not going to even feel better. And, and uh, like, guess what? You're going to feel like crap and you're not going to feel better because you're believing it. You're seeing it. You're talking your body right out of it. Right. But I am a person, I need energy. I have a lot of it already. God definitely blessed me. But at three o'clock in the afternoon, when I pick up my kids before these products, I was the mom that's like, can we just sit on the couch for an hour, kids? And then I'm feeling so horrible because my kids are like, we just got out of school. We want to ride our bikes. And I'm like, oh, I just want to sit. And if you're like me and you sit, you're, you're done. Like once you sit on the couch, you, you might have to get up and, and, and make dinner. But now like we don't sit, we, we go to the park for an hour every day after school. Um, you know, we're outside now. Thank God we live in Arizona. So we have gorgeous weather here. So we're riding scooters, we're riding bikes. And I don't have to worry about I'm going to crash my energy because I have sugar and I, and I just have all this garbage or have that guilt because we know that we shouldn't be drinking Red Bull, but we're drinking Red Bull because we, we have been sold on the idea of we need external ingredients to give us that energy. But we don't. We need to we need to fuel our bodies. Our bodies know exactly what to do, but God gave us fuel in the form of food that we need without all the chemicals and without all the reasons why it's allowed to sit on a shelf for six months. We need it in this kind of form because our body uses it instantly so that that energy stays sustainable. And then it, it, it goes beyond that. And I'm not even going to get into that, but it goes beyond that to work at the cellular level so that you can actually start to reverse things that are happening inside. And that's just from a mom's Per, per, you know, th without the science jargon, like that's what it's doing. That's what I know it's doing because I've met these people in our, in our community and, and, and they're sharing. I mean, we have a woman here that had diabetes and I'm not going to share her story because it's got some numbers and I don't want to, to misrepresent, but I will tell you changing her life. I mean, she, she cries every time she shares her story and it's like a shake changed. Her, yeah. A shake changed my life. You know, it's, it's, oh, it's just, it's incredible what we're doing over here. I just love it. So I just wanted you're, to. You're right. And, and, and forgive me. And, and this is why I think we work so well together as this yin and yang, right? Is because if I get so passionate, you know, from the medical aspect of it, and you are absolutely so grounded as the mom aspect of it. And, and I, I mean, I even saw your kids, you know, taking some of the supplements yes. and, and that's, what's so powerful is, you know, you know, based on, on on the labels on the bottle, up to age or uh, after age four years old, we have uh, our kids consuming all of the greens and and some of the other products as well. My and year is, and a half year old does does drink. Uh, he drinks about like a quarter of a sippy cup every morning of greens, and he loves it. He's a year and a half old. Yeah, because he doesn't know any different. No, right? If, if we only taught it. our kids, you know, what we want them to, to do initially, they're going to do for the rest of their life. Right. And forget the influence of others and, you know, the negative beliefs that we end up developing ourselves. Yeah. So th th there's a, those are just a, a couple of the products. And we probably don't have enough time to go over every single product here. Again, we're not all of the product experts um, right. and, you know, all of that stuff we can send you some links to kind of show you where that is. But I want to give you some testimonials, right? So this right here is vitamin D. So vitamin D. So here's my, my issue my entire life is I have never, 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 never had a normal vitamin D level um, from the time it started to get checked when I was in high school. Wow. I started having a lot of fatigue and I had a lot of, you know, chronic, you know, uh, complaints that I was doing. And so my mom took me to the doctor and they tested blood work and my vitamin D level was very, very um, uh, low in the single digit low. And we don't have to know what normal is, uh, but we know that if we feel bad and the doctors tell us that your level is low, I ended up having to take every single year uh, through my adult life uh, a, a medication at the beginning of the year for three months. Once wow. a week for three months. Okay. And you know, as kids, they probably don't like to take medicines. They don't like to take pills as adults. We think we know it all and we forget. And if we forget to take medicine, then we don't have good results, right? As with anything. And I will tell you as a white boy with red hair who goes out into the sun 
and puts all the sunblock on to prevent all the natural vitamin D, I wonder why my vitamin D was low. Sure. And, and then as an adult, I go and I work nights for 20 plus years and I never see the sun. And I wonder why I'm not as healthy as I can be because I don't have the natural exposure that God gave us to be able to give us the nutrients that we need. Fact. So it wasn't until less than a year ago, right? More than four decades of going through this. Less than a year ago, Dr. Cohn um, had this product called vitamin D. Okay. Now vitamin D, uh, and I will do this right here. I take one capsule a day and I'll, I'll tell you, I, I, because my vitamin D was so low, um, the bottle says serving size, one tablet, chewable, tastes phenomenal. Really? I didn't know that. And so it's a chewable tab. And I said, hey, you know, my vitamin D has been so low. I'm going to take two of these. And I had my blood test checked before I started it. And I had my blood check test in 30 days. When I went to my doctor, I said, okay, I want to check. I want to recheck my uh, vitamin D level in 30 days. And, and she said, uh, we don't recommend that. We recommend to do it in about three months because it takes about three months for your vitamin D level to, to normalize. I will tell you a number. You don't have to know normal or not. I'm going to tell you the abnormal number was 16. My vitamin D level was 16, which was super low. I took two of these for 30 days and I had my blood check and my number was 64, which is a little bit more little than bit. normal. Right. Um, and so I went to my doctor, Dr. Cohn, and I shared these results with him. And I said, hey, look, this is absolutely phenomenal. Here's my results. Uh, he said he asked me, he says, how many are you taking? I said, I'm taking two a day. He says, Jason, I put the best in the best in here. I manufactured these for exactly what you need. Take what the bottle says. Yeah. Okay. Yes. <laughs> I don't know more than my doctor. Yeah, Dr. Yeah, yeah, Cohen. Yeah. Take what's recommended on the bottle. Yeah. I've been taking one a day, every single day, chewable cap, first thing in the morning. I have felt phenomenal. My fatigue is gone. Yes. Uh, I mean, we'll have fatigue for other stuff if I'm not sleeping or working late hours. So don't get me wrong. It's not a miracle that's going to change yeah. all of the stupid things that I do to myself, right? But to understand that it is so powerful and genetics play a big role. And I know this because my son... Also, white, redhead, <laughs> burns in the sun, uses yeah. sunblock, also had a uh, very low level and became normalized after, again, 30 days. Mm -hmm. And we did that just because we wanted to prove to ourselves before we can share it with the world that this actually works. Yeah. Well, I will tell you with 100% certainty, this vitamin D, I don't have to take you know, pills uh, that are prescription and super difficult on my body yeah. um, for once a week for three months. You know, what we've got here is absolutely phenomenal. And to be able to chew it, and I'll tell you this, Jen, when you start chewing your food, okay, when you chew your food, it starts absorbing in your mouth yes. and it immediately goes into your bloodstream. And that's the best way to, to consume nutrients. And yeah. so when we start having chewable supplements like this, um, it's, it's game over. Yeah. Now you have your own uh, testimonial, I believe. Yeah, like speaking of chewable, I didn't bring them. They're sitting on the counter over here. But um, Grab yeah, it. so, so okay, I will. I'm like, I get so excited. I'm like, I will. It's my recovery. All right. Yeah, see, this is like totally unscripted, not prepared. We're just sharing passion, guys. So, yeah, pop your questions in. If you guys have questions, throw them in the comments. Um, if you're watching this live, hashtag live, you're watching this on replay, hashtag replay, put the comments in there. We'll absolutely get back to you on that. But Jen, yeah, tell me about your little magic yeah. there. So I I'm going to tell you, first of all, I am, I, I don't consider myself skeptic, but when everyone's like, oh my God, we all take it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a part of me that's like, really? So I've been with the company for six months and I had this bottle the whole time. And did, I don't, I don't consider myself a, a person of discomfort. Right. So for me, I'm like, I don't need it. I don't, I don't have any of that. 
um, trying to give it to my husband all day long, but he's like, well, you're not taking it. So I'm not taking it. So I come home from Denver, our last event. Thank God, first of all, it's chewable because I am also one of those people that have a hard time swallowing pills and I do take all of our products. So it does get sometimes difficult, challenging, challenging. So I come home and my freaking toe is like size three, right? I had broken my toe. You can't do anything for a broken toe, even taping it. Like there's nothing you can do. But I will tell you the discomfort. Um, I was basically walking on my heel for like two months, just, just kind of like dealing with it. And you get to the point, and, and, and mine's a broken toe, so this is not chronic. But you still get to a point where you're like, I, I feel like I'm going to deal with this forever. Like I'm mm-hmm. always going to feel like, am I always going to feel like this? And um, so I'm going to, you know, I'm going to pop mine. So I, right, skeptically, I ordered my bottle. 20 minutes later, right? I'm in a hotel room because we use our travel discount. So we're at a staycation. I'm like, babe, I could wiggle my toe. He's looking at me like, I'm like, no, I swear to God. I look, look at my toe. I'm wiggling my toe. Before I could not even move my toe on my own. Like there was no way. I'm like, no, I can move my toe. So I was like, oh, <laughs> right? <laughs> Follow the bottle. Follow the bottle. It's molecular hydrogen. And I asked my doctor because he's part of our community. Um, and, and thankfully, I can, I can take a little more as needed. Uh, and so I did. I wanted to really saturate it so that it was getting into my body. Um, and now I take them. Now that I understand why my cells need to stay in this state, I continue to take it. But I did not have, I mean, Again, no miracles. I didn't wake up and be like, oh, no more broken toe. Like, no, still broken, (laughs) right? Still popping. Um, But I will tell you, uh, because I did a video that went viral, because the, the bigger conversation, and I'm not telling you what not to take. I'm telling you as a as a mom, as a 42 year old mom of children, right? So there's a wisdom gap there that a 20 year old parent doesn't have. And a 42 year old parent is like, okay, so there's actually long term effects when we do take things that other people recommend, right? And I'm not going to go into that. But I will tell you based on the video, how many comments with my ulcers, my stomach, my lining surgery, I mean, so many sad stories of people that were taking something else as a supplement to band-aid, right? Because this is not a band-aid. This goes in at the cellular level. What this does for visual, right? I have a visual, right? So if you have any discomfort in your body, you basically have something that's throbbing, right? It's like a fire. It's like on fire. This is like a fire. This is like water, just gushing water on that fire immediately. It goes in, it finds that heat and it just saturates it with water. So there's, there's almost an immediate depending on your body and all that stuff, relief of discomfort. But if you're using something else just because our moms did and our grandpas did and we don't know any better, the side effects, which are on the side of the bottle, as well as they verbally tell you on the commercials, do way more damage. And this does none. There's no damage to this. So so I am now one of those crazy people that's like, well, what do you need to recover from? Because here you go. Like, and this one is good for kids um, four and over. So if my daughter has a fever, if she comes home, my daughter the other night was like, mom, my back hurts. And I'm thinking you're seven. What does your back hurt? But she's like a, a contortionist. She watches all these YouTube contortionists. So she's like doing all these things. So yeah, your back hurts. You're stretching your muscles. That's a real thing even for a seven-year-old. And so instead of giving her something else, she just choose some of these. So amazing, amazing product. And there's there's a reason why it's our number one seller. And it doesn't really need that much information on it. Because of these stories, people are like, right? I, I love how we say it. You get your health back, you get your life back, or you get your money back. Like, hashtag no brainer. Yeah, no, absolutely. And and it sounds like your bottle's a little bit on the empty side there. Mm-hmm. I have two, though. I have more. <laughs> so, well, then- so Jennifer had mentioned uh, molecular hydrogen. These are big terms. Uh, you know, neither one of us can sit here and have a scientific conversation about what exactly molecular hydrogen does. But I will tell you that um, we, we probably understand a little bit about pH and we have high pH water. There's a reason why 
the 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 consumers uh, and the the marketers out there, you know, say, hey, get you know, um, 8.5 or 9.0, you know, uh, you know, water because it's going to help you become in, in an alkaline state, whatever. Right. So what we want to do is we want to make sure that you have all of the information that you need because we're not product experts. OK, there are pl plenty of people out there who know way more than we do. I just put a link in the comments. You can see it on 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 here. You go to recovery.healthmadesimple.info and you'll be able to see a page on there that has all of the information that you're looking for. Um, there's a video from Dr. Cohn uh, talking about it, you know, the creator of the product. There's a video from his partner, uh, Nathaniel, who is an expert of molecular hydrogen. He teaches at universities. He's he's a, a doctor that knows way more about this than than probably all of our physicians do, right? Yeah. That we see on a regular basis. So we encourage you to go to the website, get all the information. The uh, molecularhydrogen.com is a third party, completely separate than what we have. New England Journal of Medicine, all of the medical research that's out there, this is publication there. So I just want to make sure everybody has an opportunity to uh, take a look at that. But thank you, Jennifer, for sharing that story, because that's really what we have. And if you guys have a story about one of our products that we're talking about, please put it in the comment, because people that are reading this and rewatching this, we need to hear from other people because that's where the belief is. Yeah. It's not about just Jen and Jay talking about what they've had and what they're doing in their business. No. We're here to share the message. And that's what we're doing every single day here is we're sharing the message because when people have been coming to us and telling us a little bit about what they're experiencing, it's great. It makes us feel good, but you need to hear it. Yeah. The world needs to hear what your story is. So thank you, Jennifer, for, for sharing your little story there. Is yeah. there, uh, uh, um, oh yeah, and I've got, so there's also there's also a special over there that you can get, buy three, get one free. These are not the chewable ones, but you can you take these normally. Um, looking for savings if you're looking out there and you really have some discomfort or something that you're wanting to uh, really take care of uh, and you want to get a uh, bulk buy, there's, there's an opportunity to, to get a free bottle out there as well. So you can see all that on that site. But is there another product that you are just absolutely um, in love with that you want to talk about real quick? Yeah. And then I want to just with respect to everybody's time, I don't know where we are, what we want to do, but I do want to make sure that we talk about the, the, the telemedicine. Yeah, absolutely. And, and why we'll just do one more product and then we'll talk into that. Cool. So um, probiotics and again, just the mom that doesn't want the bloat right? Or, or any tummy troubles, like as women, we just don't want to have tummy troubles. We don't talk about it. It's like, we don't, that stuff happens behind closed doors, right? But it is a conversation. It's a healthy conversation. It's a natural conversation. So I'm going to actually share someone else's story um, that we saw in Denver. And I had this experience with someone else in an extended family, and it was someone that suffers from Crohn's disease. And I'm not going to share, you know, I'm not a medical doctor. I'm sharing a story that I heard from a stage. And I have physically witnessed someone as my first husband's brother um, suffers from Crohn's disease. And it's very, very painful. It's very difficult. Um, it, you, you can't work. Like there is a lot of things that comes with it. And, and this guy right here, which I can, I can do on camera also, it's a pixie stick. If you guys remember what a pixie stick yes. is, right? <laughs> that's how I like to, I'm an eighties kid, right? So it's Here's a pixie stick <laughs> and you literally just open it up. You want to do it on a, on an empty stomach, right? Cause it's going to go into the gut and do what your gut needs it to do. And, and I'm going to tell you guys, your gut manifests physically on the skin all of its challenges like 90 percent of our challenges stem from digestive systems from our gut from the way we eat all kinds of things right this tastes like tricks cereal i know it sounds weird it totally sounds weird it's amazing and you just get it all over your teeth you put it in your mouth i chew it I put it on my teeth and chew it because I do enjoy the flavor, but it melts completely as soon as it's on your tongue. Mm -hmm. And that's <laughs> it. And I've got my, I've got my probiotic 
my digestive health. No one knows what I'm doing. I can put it in my purse if I'm at work. I have them at home um, and I have a clean system. And I know I have a clean system because I have done some of that research because I do have skin challenges that comes from um, having a poor, poor gut health. And I know that it's not just the skincare that we have, but it's because of what I'm putting into my body that's clearing up my skin, which is random, but it's all connected. It's all connected. So that is my... Oh, so anyway, the gentleman that suffered for Crohn's disease, stop making it about you, Jennifer. I know. <laughs> the gentleman that suffers from Crohn's disease literally was teary eyed building a huge organization off of one product that changed his life. And so the, and this is such a perfect segue. And I'll let Jason get into the, to the telemedicine because a lot of people, I can't even tell you, and I just want to shake them. I can't afford it. Mm. Here's what I'm going to tell you. You're going to pay in money or you're going to pay in your life. Because it's not that Western medicine is right or Eastern medicine is right. It's that it's all there to work together. And you have to have the right products. And if you're on a probiotic and you're like, well, I don't want an income stream. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, we're going to share with you how you can have access to a doctor with a membership as a customer and get probiotics. And maybe you know three people that are, could use, by the way, the world needs a probiotic. Maybe you know three people that could use a probiotic and now everything is free. So I really, 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 really want to challenge those of you that are watching that have all kinds of health challenges, one health challenges, however many that think they can't afford it. You can afford it. There's a way to afford it. You have to make the decision to get out of the system that's keeping you there because you are. it is very much a system and it is designed for you to keep you coming back because the medical field is also a business. It is like we all agree and we all know that, but there are options and, uh, and you need those options and you need to know that those options are available. I don't know where my co-host just went. He just left me. <laughs> my co-host left me high and dry. All right. So, <clears throat> so, um, so with the probiotic, again, I'm not going to like preach to anybody. I just, I can't even tell you how many women don't put their health first and you're taking care of children, you're taking care of your husband, you're taking care of your mother, you're taking care of your family, you're stressing your bodies out, right? Mentally, physically, emotionally, and then saying, I can't afford it, but you can. You, you don't wanna die in your 50s or your 60s or your 70s. My grandmother lived to be 103, so y'all are stuck with me. I'm not even halfway through my life. 103, I'm 42, do the math on that. Like I'm a kid, I'm like 15 years old, right? So if like 30 was old, I'm like 15, right? So you have to make your health a priority and we have trials and we have samples and you will feel this stuff. I mean, again, I can't, we're not here, here to, to say miracles, but if you've got some challenges, we can send you some stuff that you will feel immediately. You get your life back, you get your health back, you get your money back. Boom. Now we're gonna talk Boom. about it. <clears throat> That's awesome. Well, great. So again, let's just talk about, you know, the, the value that we have here, right? And so many people, you know, struggle with going to the doctor, one, because maybe they don't want to, they're afraid to find out exactly what the doctor is going to say. But most of the time, and correct me if I'm wrong, but do you know somebody out there who is working full time and has to take off work in order to go to see a doctor? What happens when you have to take off work? Typically, we lose income. We have to take PTO or we have to take time off or we have to find coverage. And it really has become a hassle. And I don't know when the last time you have been to the doctor, but when's the last time you walked in and out in 15 minutes? Never. Right? Yeah. Usually, I have to take a, an hour just to get to the doctor and then sit in the waiting room for anywhere upward an hour, 90 minutes, two hours to see a doctor. And that's if it's scheduled. Right. If I'm scheduled at an appointment, and I'm still waiting. I'm, I'm losing four to six hours out of my day. Yeah. Now, if I were to have to go to an urgent care, then I may be waiting for eight hours before I get an opportunity to see a doctor. And so what we have access to is, you know, a, a virtual doctor that you can see pretty much within 20 minutes, make an appointment in an urgent care setting um, or a scheduled setting and just ask something that's non-emergent. If you have an emergency, obviously you're going to go to the emergency department. And if you schedule an appointment with a, a physician and they deem that you have an emergency that you need to go to the hospital, they're going to recommend you do that. 
but how many times do we as parents, Jennifer, you're, you're a mother of young kids. How many times have you woke up in the middle of the night at you know, three o'clock in the morning with your child barking like a dog, oh, yeah. right? And you're scared because you don't think they can breathe and uh, mm -hmm. you've got more than one child. So uh, I, I was there too, right? When we, had, when we had young kids, it was like, okay, so now we got to wake everybody up Right. Because maybe there's a single mom out there who has two or three kids. And now all two or three kids have to go to the urgent care or the emergency department and sit where people are sick and and expose them to God knows what. And no Lord knows these days we don't want to be exposed to something. Yeah. So it, it's such a, a pain point to figure out, OK, now it's going to really disrupt us if we have to go do that. Well, what we want to introduce you to is a, a little um benefit that we have, which is no cost. It literally is, it costs $5 to set up the account. That's it. One time, $5. And that's just a processing issue to, to get access. There's zero copay. There is zero to little wait time to speak with a, a board certified licensed physician in your state. And let's say, you know, you had mentioned something about traveling, right? So right. How, how amazing would it be to travel? And then if you go internationally, maybe you want to go to a, an all-inclusive resort in Mexico and something happens and you, you get sick, right? That tends to happen sometimes, yeah. right? And if you were to, to call your physician, they can't help you when you're overseas, right? When you're across borders, when you're out of state, they usually can't help you because they're not licensed in that state. Well, what if you're someone with a language barrier, right? Sure. Like you're that, that scary, right? Like I can't even speak to a physician in this country. Yeah, absolutely. And, uh, and let alone the middle of the night, maybe you do yeah. have a good relationship with your, with your physician and you're at home and your doctor is sleeping and, and they have to call him and, you know, maybe it's going to take a couple hours for him to get back to you. We, as parents want to know the answer now, because we're probably pretty scared, right? Yeah. Well, we have this uh, thing called the telemedicine and everybody's probably familiar now with a little bit of telehealth or telemedicine. But here's what we have access to with this, uh, this platform. As I can go on from my desktop, I can go on from my mobile phone and I can schedule an appointment. Now this is just a picture, it's not a live feed, but I want you to understand that on the left side here, you can actually pick, make an appointment, book an appointment and choose whether it's an urgent care or a regular appointment. And you can see that up in the top right, here's an urgent care. You can see that I've used this before with Dr. Uh, Scott over here, right? So all of my medical records are gonna be archived right here. So if I end up going to see my doctor and say, hey, I had an emergency when I was uh, in Dallas and I called at two o'clock in the morning, I spoke with a, a telemedicine doctor. Uh, here's what he prescribed me um, for whatever ailment that I had. And then I go back to my doctor and now he has access to all those medical records. Yeah. How powerful is that? <laughs> couple, couple testimonial stories is uh, one of a very good friend of mine was actually in Mexico, ended up having a problem with his, you know, kidney, right? And in a foreign country and having a medical emergency uh, to be able to first reach out and connect with the doctor and say, hey, what's going on? What do I need to do? Um, well, I think this, this, and this is the issue. I think you need to, you know, come home immediately and come to the hospital. Mm. Right. So to be able to have that, do I have a kidney stone? Do I have something else? Do I have an, a, a urinary tract infection? Something simple like that. The, the physician that is where you're at, licensed where you are at physically, can call in a prescription if needed, give you medical advice that Jennifer and I can't give you. Right. As friends and family members always like to give us. <laughs> not always. The best right. And so to have 24 hour, uh, seven days a week access internationally in, in well over 30 countries right now, or I'm sorry, and well, speaking well over 30 languages right now, right? And how powerful that is. Mm -hmm. More information on that, if you go to the website here, wellcarelegacy.com, you'll be able to kind of see all of the information and you frequently ask questions that you may have and, uh, and get some more questions answered. Certainly, if you have additional questions, put them in the comment section below. But just real quickly, we wanted to kind of wrap up with, you know, the whole health made simple. 
<clears throat> it's not only about what we're consuming to understand we have to take care of the host first and foremost, yeah. right? Because if we take care of the host, then disease and issues and stuff probably won't happen. Genetics does play a part of things. And so sometimes we have issues that we have to see a medical doctor for and supplements and, and vegetables and eating normal and eating right won't always fix everything, but it will fix most. It will prevent most things from happening. And if you have questions more on the molecular hydrogen that Jennifer had mentioned, again, go to the website, listen to the experts. That's a third party that talks about all of the, the medical research if you're, if you're somebody who really wants those details. And if you're somebody who just wants to continue to live life and travel without having any type of uh, re resistance because you have a medical condition or you're worried about getting sick somewhere else, and knowing that you now have access to a physician 24 hours a day, seven mm -hmm. days a week is so powerful and, and to be able to tap into something like that. The products that we talked about the, is only a, a few, right? So it depends on what it is that you're needing. If you have specific questions or, or desires, make sure you're reaching out to whoever's inviting you to this to come get that information to Jennifer or I. We're happy to answer those questions and or direct you to where you can get the answers. Jennifer, yeah. do you have anything else to kind of close out here? Yeah, if you could just put that last slide about the one, two, three and health made simple. I just have one point I want to make. People like if I got a diagnosis, God forbid, someone got, I went to the doctor and the doctor said, Jen, you have X. We'll talk about someone I know, I won't say any names, but someone I know was misdiagnosed with diabetes, did not have diabetes. Okay. Misdiagnosed, put on all the stuff. Here's what happens. A lot of times if we get a diagnosis and, and let me just remind you that doctors are people that learned from a book and had some experiences right? So they're also doing recommendations. It's not fact-based all of the time. And if I were misdiagnosed, then a lot of times what we want to do is we want to go talk to other people who have something. And when people write reviews, people complain. People do not share gratification, gratitude, appreciation a lot. They want to say, this didn't work, that didn't work, this sucked, this blows, this, 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 that. But we can look at history and see that people have survived AIDS, people have survived cancer, people have survived diabetes, people have survived hypo, hyper, thyroid, all the things. We can look. I would challenge you to go find those stories. And here's why, because your belief in your health is far more important than what you're gonna put into your body first and foremost. You gotta believe that you can be healthier. So don't go talk to sick people. Go to talk, go talk to the cancer survivors. Talk to my girlfriend, Shar, who had a tumor in her brain as well as a 20 year cancer survivor. Talk to the patients that Jason's had that are on the other side of what they had. Don't go read reviews and here's why. You have no idea that person that's complaining about A, B or C, their history, their experience, what was in their gut, what was in their body, what was in their thought process. So don't make an, a, a decision that is literally based on your health, based on someone saying it didn't work. I would go talk to the person who said it did work. And here's, here's why, because I kept on it for 90 days instead of three. I kept on, I, I did it for, you know, I saturated my body instead of this. I added the hydro. I was talking to someone today. Is like, I said, you got to add the, add the hydro on top of the recovery. I really want to just change that conversation People complain because we're conditioned to find what's wrong. But if we know that people have survived from it, it's not about money. It's not about money. It's about being resourceful. And we know because our products are not brand new, right? They've been around. Our doctor's been around for 30 years, which means the survivor stories exist. So start talking to the people who have survived, who are thriving. Maybe it's not something they can survive with because I don't want to do any kind of, you know, I don't want to, you know, be a magical unicorn in, in a sky of, of, well, Jen, I've had this for 20 years. I get it. I hear it. But don't go commiserate with a lot of people who, have, who are suffering. Go talk to the one person that survived because I'm the four minute mile girl. And if Jason can run the four minute mile, then all, all I need to know is I can run it too. I don't need to beat him. I just need to do it too. 
And so we are literally sharing with you that people have survived Crohn's disease. They're thriving with different illnesses and ailments and, and things going on because they've educated their body and because they changed their thought process into believing I can beat this. I can cure this. It's a free will. It's a thought. It's a process. And we're not going anywhere. You guys think like, oh, Jen and Jay are going live. Just wait. Just wait. Because the more stories that I hear, the more inspired I am to freaking be live 24-7 trying to shake some of you people. Like, if you can't afford it, then you need to get in my inbox so I can tell you how to share it with three people and I'll send it to you for free. Okay? Your health has got to be, it's more important than money. It's more important than buying. It, your health is everything. If you don't have it, you have nothing. And so many people are conditioned to believe that this is just the way it is. And it's not, but it takes time. It took time to grow the disease. It's going to get take time to get rid of it. But I just want you to know that Jason and I are here with you on the journey. We want to hold your hand. Our community wants to support you. And we want you to know that we know it's not going to be easy. I, I, listen, I can't like losing weight. It's like the worst conversation I like to have. Mm -hmm. But I'm learning because of what I'm not trying to lose weight by dieting. I, I had someone last night ask me, Jen, are you losing weight? And I said, we don't talk about that. And she kind of looked at me and I said, I'm a mom who's been trying to lose weight since I started comparing myself to Cosmo girls when I was 12 years old. It's been a constant conversation. I had an eating disorder as a child. I don't really talk about it. I don't talk about it now because I don't want my girls to know that eating disorder exists, not because they're ignorant, but because they know that their mom has a healthy body image. And that's the most important thing is what are we raising and what are we raising them to believe? And I just want you to know that I believe in you and anything that you're dealing with. And Jason believes in you and we, we know we have it. And so we just want to offer it to you in any way that that fits for you. So that's, that's all I got. That's awesome. And it touches me just to hear you say that um, over and over again. And if you're interested in kind of hearing more and continuing to follow us, uh, make sure you click on the link clublifesociety.com. Come join our community. Uh, we're, we're actually streaming this live in there right now, as well as many other platforms that you may be watching, whether you're on YouTube or Facebook or one of the other uh, social media platforms that we're sharing this out with. But here's the hub and, and here's where you're going to constantly get all the information, all the details. It, there's no cost to join this community. We're right. part of a family. So make sure you come in. You know, uh, it's just going to ask you a couple of questions to see who invited you. And if it wasn't Jen or, or I that invited you, put the person's name that does, because we want to make sure that our family gets taken care of by the people that, you know, they're surrounded by. And yeah. so that's what this is. It's it's an open platform. We're going to continue to share information. Uh, we're going to celebrate your successes, your wins, your your uh, recovery from whatever you've got going on and all of your testimonials. So thank you guys very much for sticking with us for these last 55 minutes. I hope you enjoyed it. If there's something else specific that you guys want to know, we're going to be doing this nearly daily uh, because the information just has to get out there. So post some comments, reach out to us. Thank you guys. You have a good day. Thanks, Jay. Bye.